Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 34, and this is war number 10. We've got two wars after this one before the season ends. And we're going up against an alliance called Ethereum. All right, so let's go ahead and first we're going to go in this way. Ugh. All right, so this team knows about Spider-Man 2099. I hate that. Um, but they've banned him. They've banned Human Torch. They banned Doom. Ugh, I swear. All right, anyway, let's uh, preview. And it's late here. I almost forgot. Look at that. My, my teammates are already in there. It's 11.30 p.m. right now. All right, so we've got this guy here, Ultron. We've got uh, Doc Ock. All right. What's the global here? Unstoppable armor, of course. All right. Um, I mean, Claire can do those fights, no problem. We don't have to worry about the mini. And it looks like they've already cleared the middle. Wow. No bonus, so they, uh, I don't know who was there. They tore him up. And here we've got Guardian. All right. And I take path three, sections one and two, in case uh, you didn't know already. And we've got, hmm, Angela. Wow, they are really, they lined up my path. What, why? Are y'all, do y'all hate me? Is that what it is? I just noticed that. Y'all y'all hate me, don't you? So you you got rid of my favorite champion, at least my favorite boss killer, Spider-Man 2099, and everyone on my path is benefiting from unstoppable armor. Really? That's how y'all gonna do it? Okay. Um... But Claire should be able to handle these fights, so not that big of a deal. Um, this one, ugh. Uh, I'll probably be bringing in a uh, Warlock. And, oh boy, Sasquatch. Yeah, that's why they took out Human Torch and um, Spider-Man 2099. The two biggest threats, I would say, to that Sasquatch. Yeah, that'll be fun. These guys seem to know what they're doing here. All right, and let's see. Yeah, they do have a lot of Mystic Champions, so they wouldn't want Human Torch. Yeah, I see. All right, well, we're going to have to use Claire. I thought about, since AQ is not on right now, um, but it's about to be, I could bring in uh, Corvus as well he could take those two without too much difficulty he could possibly take out uh this one here guardian as well but then he probably wouldn't be all that great for the rest of these maybe a uh, penny but no i think i'm gonna bring um Warlock. Warlock, as I learned, is not that great against that Sasquatch. Um, but anyway. Yeah. Black Widow, Nick Fury. Nick Fury can take that uh, Guardian if I'm just really careful. And don't... Yeah. If I don't... Um gain buffs, decks, and all that good stuff. I should be fine. Okay. Yeah. All right. So let's get on with the fighting. All right. We're back. We're going to jump on into it. Uh, at the time of this recording, uh, war season is over. I have not done a war rewards opening or anything like that. We also finally got the big compensation uh, that Kabam was promising us. I don't know if they're going to be more compensations coming or what, 
but I like this compensation package. I realize not everybody does, depends on whether it meets your needs and expectations. However, I got rank four materials. That's pretty much what I love about that package. And I got just enough that I'm gonna be able to uh, rank four my first champion very, very soon. Uh, not sure exactly when, but definitely after 4th of July, but possibly before that. All right, so first fight, we've got Ultron. Now, this was actually a little bit of a tricky fight. Uh, I was like, okay, wait a minute. You know, he has been upgraded. He evades, but he evades on a timer now. But you'll notice that a lot of times he waits around uh, until his evade is popping up and then he'll fire a special one so you couldn't punish it quite right. And then we've got unstoppable armor and his unstoppable. So wasn't the quick fight that I thought it was gonna be. You look at that, he's unstoppable again. So as you can see, you know, he's evading, he's going unstoppable, so not great. So I went all the way to a special three because guess what? Unstoppable evades don't matter. So I went and fired off a special three and I was fully prepared to uh, just cycle special threes if that's what it took for this fight, okay? So as you can see here, we're not doing a whole lot of damage. You see how I'm just tapping him? One, two, one, two, because of that unstoppable and his evade and all this other stuff. Um, so I don't wanna do full five hit combos, they're risky. And uh, the last time I did it, I got hit because he went unstoppable in the middle of it. Uh, so with that wasn't cool. And as you can see, I'm just playing it safe here. Playing it safe. Parry, back off. Parry, hit him a few times. I was waiting out that unstoppable armor timer there. All right, and here we go again. Finally, we can uh, hit him with that special two. And look at that. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Why didn't I do a lot of damage? What happened? But we got him down. I was expecting that special two to finish him off. And when it didn't, I started getting nervous. I'm like, okay, not only do I take the recoil damage, but he really didn't take a lot of damage at all. So I was like, oh man. But we got him down. Now this fight, I learned from fighting Doc Ock before, he is nasty with that unstoppable armor. He's got a lot of buffs up and it's harder for me to, you know, track all of them. And I, I don't like that. I don't like, uh, I don't like it when the fight is made difficult because of a user interface type of an issue. Okay, so I'm trying to keep track of the timer. All right, and it's right there in front, so that was good. He got an armor up, but it didn't proc the unstoppable that time, so we were good. But boom, he got another armor up, and he's unstoppable before the even timer ran out. That's what he does. And I'm just like, are you kidding? I thought I had it, you know, pretty, uh, my, my plan was pretty straight. You know, wait out that timer. But he also gets armor ups, so he can be tricky. So I was like, okay, we gotta, we gotta, you know, be careful. Boom. I decided to hit him with a heavy attack and not go into any um, uh, combos because uh, quite frankly, I was afraid of that uh, unstoppable. Didn't want to deal with it. Hit him with that heavy attack. We were good. All right, so mini already taken down. Go into the middle. Middle is already cleared, but I've got energy. And look, I can reach Guardian. Hmm. EMP modification, no unstoppable armor. And I've got Nick Fury and the life model decoy is active. Let's do it. So what I don't wanna do is I don't wanna generate buffs. So dexing, that generates a buff if you have that mastery point, uh, point in that mastery. Um, and it will cause you to degen. That EMP modification, you'll get all those shocks. So that's why you see me blocking most of the time, 
and I'll evade if I can evade safely from a distance. All right, so here we go. Now at this point, I'm like, okay, we gotta get him to fire that special uh, two. All right, but he's not one to do it. And then finally he does it and catches me. Now that would have killed me, but that's why I like Nick Fury. That would have been it, just that quick. Special two, boom, boom, and I'd have been done. But Nick Fury, that just destroyed his life model decoy. Love Nick Fury. Absolutely love Nick Fury, okay? And that's why. So that saved me a death. Now, granted, if you want to use a invulnerability boost, you do the same thing. But I didn't need to because I got Nick. All right. So I went to bed, woke back up, and uh, continued on my merry way. So this one here, now you know Angela likes her buffs. And one of the buffs she does get periodically is an armor up buff. They have unstoppable armor. So that can be a pain. But Claire can strip her of all that. Sounds kind of naughty, doesn't it? But yeah, Claire can strip her of all her armor. Okay, see she had an armor up and Claire took it right off. So mostly what I have to deal with here is the unstoppable armor timer. Unlike on that other node where my nullifies had a chance to fail, a big chance, not so here. All right, so you see she did go unstoppable and I'm just blocking it. All right, boom, got rid of that. And I did take a little bit of that uh, bleed damage because I switched into uh, Curse of Hellfire but we finished her off, didn't hurt that much, and the fight was over pretty quickly. So she is a good option, just like Colossus, but just like Colossus, Claire can uh, take her down pretty easy uh, on that note especially. All right, so now we're going to fight Cosmic Ghost Rider. And I wasn't too worried about him. Yes, he has unstoppable armor, but he doesn't generate his own armors. So wasn't too worried about him. You know, I, I healed up a little bit. And um, just went in. The explosive personality doesn't bother me because even if I hit into their block, um, I will strip the armor up. But look at that, boom. As Soon as I said that, armor up, unstoppable. And I'm like, oh, are you kidding me? And at first I was like, wait, did he generate an armor up or was that the... Um, unstoppable armor so I was like I didn't think he fired up uh armor ups but it happened so quickly you know all right so here we go I'm watching the timer now because I already got burnt by it once and I can evade both his specials so that's no problem fire off that special uh two took out a nice good chunk of his health just keep going in we got the timer on our side and we are done with him Nice, smooth, and easy. Now, I don't think I got, let me see, did I get the, uh, yeah. I ended up uh, fighting this mini as well. Um, I think, yeah, I think uh, he went in and, yeah. Uh, he went in and uh, died. And uh, so I'm coming in. And at this point, I wasn't sure how many points we had left on this node, but didn't really matter. I was still gonna boost like I usually do for this node. And you already know who I'm going in with. Warlock. Love me some Warlock. All right. And uh, decided to use some of these because why not? I don't, I don't really use them a whole lot. And especially on this node, since I like to ignore the node, see the strike counter and all that, I, I like to ignore all that. And he's got unstoppable armor too. I'm just like, all right, bet. Let's see what we got. So of course, buffet. So you see he regen right off the bat. So all the damage that my alliance mate did, most of it gone already. All right, so here we go. Didn't want to get caught in the corner. Got my infections up on him. And I got my special two off, which is why I put that um, power boost on. So he's almost at half his health already. 
And then I got caught by that. And I'm like, really? Really? I'm like, all right. That woke me up. And he's less than half his health. And I'm like, yeah. Can I get to that next special too? And I'm like, no, almost, almost got to a second special too. But I'm already shut down. And I thought with all the boosts and everything that I put on, that I'd be able to get like two special twos out of this. No, nah. but got so close, so close. Um, I probably could have if I got hit more or something like that, but mm, that's fine. And then he hit me with that. I'm like, ooh, okay. He's a little spicy. And I'm looking at his health here, and I'm just like, boom. We got him down. All right, so no boss fight for this particular war. Uh, I went to uh, mini boss island like I usually do, and I wasn't needed. Uh, as you'll see in a moment, they had Sasquatch as a boss, and uh, I did not bring... Uh, Spider-Man 2099 because they banned him. Um, I think they banned him in this war too. I was not happy. But anyway, um, that was it for me for this war. And we'll be back and you'll see how this war ended. And we're back. And unfortunately, we lost this war. It was actually a pretty close war. Not bad. Let's take a look here. As you can see. They had one more attack bonus, and we died three more times than they did. Ghost Fade, MVP, I see you, brother. Um, but anyway, that's going to do it. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And we all hope you all have a blessed day.